Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Carly. And I'm Ange. And today we're watching Attack on Titan Season 3, Episode 7. Aaron 80's old man. Oh my gosh. Yeah. You were right. Yeah. That was a massive one. That was a pretty good one. I'm not going to lie. At the time, I didn't really celebrate it. I was trying to listen. There was some important information, you know? The outros are for the celebration. That's right. Yeah. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. Mm -hmm. uh, someone made a good point that ever since I parted away with the basement, I've been a little bit more on, you know? Okay, so you've let go and that's allowed you to grow as a person. That's right. Yeah. That's exactly right. <laughs> but last episode was really important, right? We're kind of learning how the Titan abilities work, all this stuff with the memories. Yes. I think we've got a couple of predictions on, on how it's all going to go, whether or not Rod's planning on using his daughter to become a Titan, mm. to eat Eren, or whether or not he's going to do it himself. Yeah. Um, it kind of looks like it's setting up for Historia to do it. And there's also a thing of what's going on with Freida. Yeah, Freida seems pretty important to the story of Attack on Titan by the looks of things. Yeah. So I think we'll learn a little bit more about the extent of her importance. Mm. If I do remember, Historia was asking her father where she was. Mm. And he said something like, she's not around anymore. Or mm. something something that implied that she might not be dead. Okay. Yeah. Interesting pickup. I also noticed that Kenny doesn't really like Rod. Mm. I'm not quite sure the extent of their relationship, but... He's definitely got ulterior motives. Yeah. I kind of see Kenny as a little bit of a lone wolf. I don't know. I yep. reckon he might split off from the from that group. After he gets what he wants? Maybe. maybe. Yeah. I'm not entirely sure. I mean, the show's starting to get a little bit serious. <laughs> it's always been serious, but yeah. you know, like, we're uncovering quite a bit now, even though more questions seem to be popping up. I think the biggest question that we have now from last episode is why did Grisha massacre that family? Yes. That, what's going on there? That's a big mystery. He doesn't seem like a mass murderer to me. He yeah. seems like quite a smart man. Yeah. I'm thinking Rod is very shifty. I think you're right. Ever since you kind of said that you think Rod is... I don't trust Rod. Yeah, Rod's got some, some bad vibes. Yeah. I, I tend to sort of agree with you now. Rewatching him during editing and stuff mm. like I don't like his face. Right. <laughs> I don't. Angelo. No, no, no. I'm sorry. I don't like his vibe. He's got like this. <laughs> his. I think you meant to say his expressions. His expressions. Yeah. I don't like his expressions. He's got a lovely face. <laughs> I mean, you were starting to crush on Grisha's Titan. The hot Titan. The hot you Titan. You call him what he's named properly, please. The hot Titan. That's outrageous. Choose him or. Irwin. It was either <laughs> seriously. It was either the hot titan or the daddy titan. <laughs> I think we'll stick with the hot titan. We'll stick with the hot titan. I think we'll stick with the hot titan. I mean, okay. you gotta just choose your men seriously because you've been crushing <laughs> over Irwin as well. Yeah. So to everyone who thought that I was the only simp on the channel, <laughs> that's not true. I know you guys see me simping over a lot of the characters, but Carly does the same thing. I don't know if it's simping or just appreciation, you know? I'm throwing you under the bus with me. The scouts are actually, they found the secret door to the room. Oh. Yeah, remember what? towards the end of the episode, actually, now that I'm remembering. So they're there. So I think oh my gosh. this episode of Fight's going to break loose. Mikasa's going to go crazy. She's going to go crazy, and I'm so excited to I see it. I can't wait to see it. I'm so excited. All right, should we get into it? Let's get into it. We just wanted to say a massive thank you to all of our Patreon members and moderators. Thank you for all your love and support on the channel. Just a reminder, you can get early access to all of these videos over on Patreon, and the full-length reaction to this episode will be there as well. Okay. Kind of what you said, yeah. Yeah. Oh, her memories. Mm -hmm. Oh, what's he got in the bag? Oh, is she in there? The Titan syringe. Oh. Avenge your mother. What 
What's he freaking out about? Here we go. Gunpowder or something? Here comes the fight. Yes! They know how to make an entrance. Yes! Go, Sasha. Oh, that's right, gunpowder. Oh no. <laughs> Why? Is that all they had? They're kind of used to the smoke signals, I think. It's a way of communication for them. Okay. Come on, Shaw. Yes. Oh, okay. They're going to play dirty. Oh, dang. Okay, so they're using it as like a camouflage. Ooh. Yep, they're not messing about. Mm -mm. Nope, not this time. Uh. Oh, look, she's so focused. Oh, they have to reload. Okay, Armin's a good strategist. Mm hmm. And Levi too. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> I've been waiting for this. <laughs> <laughs> She's just whooped their asses. <laughs> oh no. no. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> He's such a smart Alec. Are they actually gonna fight? <laughs> oh, the music. <laughs> but Levi learnt heaps of his fighting abilities. Yeah. From Kenny. Oh, he got him. Is that a first? Kenny's a badass. Mm. Oh! Oh! Oh, he's mad now. Let's go, Levi. Hanji has so much fun. I know. Oh, be careful. <gasps> you got a shoulder? No. Oh my gosh. Hey. Oh. Okay. Oh. Can someone go help? No way. She's got to be messed up after that. The ritual. Yeah. Oh. Spinal, oh, spinal flu fluid. Okay, spinal fluid. It's kind of right. I said DNA. Mm. Why doesn't he want it to happen? Because well, he knows what it is. She probably doesn't know what it is. <laughs> Rod's a fraud. The Annie Titan. It wasn't the Annie Titan. I reckon she ate the Titan that made it. Right, so she didn't lose the memories like everyone else. Okay. That's random. What? Oh my gosh. They don't need to be injected in the night. Oh my gosh. 
Oh. Founding Titan. Right, it's been passed down. Okay. okay. That makes sense. But he wants his story to do that now. That's so messed up. Why doesn't he do it himself? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. Now they want to steal it back. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. She can't fulfill the true powers. This okay. is not a race. Oh no, he's just around because he wants to know the deal. That's what he wanted to know. Oh, is that what Kenny wanted? Yeah. Okay, so he cared for his brother. Mm hmm. Oh. Yeah, she should be thinking for herself, I think. Mm -hmm. Are you serious? She should have asked more questions. How oh, is she brainwashed that quick? That's right, that's what I've been saying. Yep. He doesn't take the responsibility himself. Ooh. Why? He didn't explain it. Empty words unless you give us a reason. I was literally saying how he's going to be a lone wolf yeah. in the intro. Now he's uh -huh. fired. He got the Sackerman, as you say. But he'll be Backerman. Don't you worry. What? Oh my gosh! That was unnecessary. It's too much pressure. I don't think she'll do it. Everyone's also her friend. Don't do it. She's so gonna do it. Yeah. He just wants all the Titans gone, maybe. Oh, I feel guilty. He doesn't understand. Oh. He's remembering all the casualties. Marco. Also, he's gonna let her eat him. Yeah, I don't think she'll do it. No. Voice actor again, man. He's too good. He's making Rod reconsider. I don't like Rod. Oh, yeah. At the start of the season. Mm. She won't do it. Doesn't like needles. Now she's thinking. That's a good question. Right? Oh, she's 
He was a bad king. Are we going to see those memories? Mm. So that we're just following orders of the previous king in his image. Yeah, I guess so. She won't do it. Let's go. Yes. Suck on that rod. <laughs> See, that's an expression I like. <laughs> yes. Uh... <laughs> It's a character defining moment. Take Aaron with you. Oh no. <laughs> Even Kenny's enjoying the show. Not true. <laughs> I know, I was gonna say, slap some sense into him. Ah. Oh. Let's go, Historia. This is crazy. Uh, yeah. She's letting it all out. No. What's going to happen? Oh, no. No. Oh, crap. No, no. Oh, oh great. Oh my gosh. Oh, he's a massive skeletal titan. With a massive spine. Okay. I liked what Historia did there. Love that for her. Rod just manipulates everyone. Yeah, what the heck? You were right about Rod from the start. Did I suspect him from the start? I can't even remember now. Oh, you were just saying he's shifty, he's got bad intentions or yeah. something. Yeah, when he like rocked up halfway through Historia's life and suddenly needed her. Like, mate, where are you been? Abandoned your daughter. Rod Rice is a fitting name for him. Because he's, he's quite bland, like Rice. <laughs> His character's very bland. July. I don't like him, I'm serious. <laughs> I do like Rice, though. Oh my god. He's like unseasoned rice. Yeah, just like no salt, nothing. Yeah, like no one wants to eat just plain rice like that, really. <laughs> you want it with something. Yeah, so Eren's got the power of the founding titan. Yes, the founding titan. Who's got all the memories or something. Eren was injected with a regular titan serum. Yes. And then ate his dad who had the founding titan abilities. Yeah, because he ate Freida. Yeah, but didn't it say somewhere in there that Eren couldn't realize the full potential of it because he's not part of the bloodline? Yep. Okay, that's interesting to note. Mm -hmm. um, and all these memories date way back when, you know, like to the first king. And it was the first king who was part of the Rice bloodline yep. that made the world in his image with the walls and the control. And that's, that's sort of just been passed down through generations. And Rod, I guess thinks it's his responsibility to continue that tradition. Yeah. He's trying to get back what, what's rightfully his through Historia, not himself. But I think at the end he just got desperate. I think manipulation is hereditary because that king way back. Mm. No good. Very bad. Same as Rod. I think they've just like passed down this stupid idea from like generation to generation. I actually don't know how long ago this bad king was. I'm not sure. I think they said a hundred years or whatever. Oh, was it they, years? Yeah, okay. that was when they said that was the last time there was a Titan attack or something. I actually I don't know exactly. Mm. I, I forgot about the specific dates and all that stuff that maybe they mentioned. Yeah. No, I'm glad Historia stood up. That was amazing. Mm. That was so good. good. I was waiting for a character to show something like that. I wish Yamir could have seen. Yeah, she would have been proud of her. That's, she would have been so proud. That was awesome. And so Eren didn't transform into a titan. No. 
He just didn't feel the need to do that to protect his life. Well, his goal has always been to destroy all the Titans. So I don't know if it's because he still wanted that to go through, like go ahead. He's like, this is the way that all the Titans are going to be destroyed. Or if it was a matter of, you know, he, he felt bad that his dad did what he did, even yeah. though he doesn't know the full story. Yeah, it, it was guilt there. That was guilt by the looks of things. Um, he was going through all the casualties that he felt responsible for. Because yeah. it always had something to do with him to some degree. And so he just didn't feel like fighting for his life. He didn't have a need to fight for his life in that moment. Sad. It was sad, but then... Historia comes in with the badass. Max some sense into him. Badass lines, badass dialogue that she had that episode. She was so good. And the music just matched it perfectly. The music did match it perfectly. Actually, I want to comment on the music. The soundtrack to that episode was very interesting. It started out as like that Western theme sort of thing that they've been doing this season. Yeah. Like that Outback Kenny theme. Yep. <laughs> right? And then it kind of like morphed into this rap rock song. Yes. Did you hear that? Yes. That was interesting. It was interesting. I quite liked it. It's amazing what you can do just with like music alone. It really changes yeah. the vibe and everything of the show. Big tick for Attack on Titan is the, the OST. Yeah. Yep. Um, what happened to Hanji? Oh my gosh. Like she's one of our favorite characters. I'm not okay with that. I'm going to say that she's all right. She got like a a broken nose. I think if she died in that moment, that would have made a bigger deal of it. Oh, Maybe. Watch next episode start with like a funeral or something. I don't have time for that. Oh my gosh. Yeah. No, I don't think so. I think they tried to scare us there in that moment though. I kind of like Kenny a bit more. I don't know. He's not like... Trying to be anyone's puppy dog sort mm. of thing, you know? He's Well, he was acting the part until he found out that he couldn't obtain the power of the founding Titan. Yeah. Well, don't you remember in that flashback in the last episode how they were going through the fact that the Ackermans and the, I think it was the Eastern clan were the only ones that... Retained their memories and stuff? Yeah, couldn't be controlled by the Titans. Is he trying to get back at some people or something? They did mention Rod's younger brother, Uri. I think that was his name. Uri. Yeah. And Kenny was like... They were tight. Yeah. They were good mates or something. Mm. But yeah, I I still don't know Kenny's agendas exactly. But he's he's a pretty interesting character to say the least. Yeah. I've liked the addition of him this season. Just adds a little bit of a different element to it all. It's got mm. history with Levi and history with the Rice family. and Actually, I, we've been saying Rice. I think it is Race. Someone corrected us again. Oh, no. I just made a pun about... About Rice. About Rod Rice, but I think his name is Rod Race. I'm going to have to like change that up. Yeah. Okay, I've got it. Rod has run his race. Now, now he's finished. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> he's turned into the skeletal titan. Oh my gosh. That's um, amazing. Yeah, I'm not sure what to expect now with that. So he's going to try to eat Eren before they escape. He's just said, no, nah, screw it. I've got to carry on this. <laughs> There's no point for him anymore. Yeah, I've got to carry on this uh, tradition or whatever. The ritual, as they were calling yeah. it. Yeah. I don't know. Uh, uh, do we have a gist of what's going on? I feel like we've got a bit of a gist of what's going on. You, maybe you guys can comment on whether or not you think we're getting it. Uh, um, I think we're getting the idea, but that's a rewatch episode for me. Oh, yeah, of course. Yes. Yeah, yeah, it definitely is. A lot of these episodes are. I'm barely having time to write anything in the book. I did get down Founding Titan. Though. I know, you missed like three important sentences. <laughs> no, 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 I was glancing. Okay, good. good. I was glancing. Don't worry. <laughs> I see you guys. You're like, oh, Ange, when you're writing, you're going to miss the dialogue. I saw the dialogue. Don't worry. I glance. <laughs> It just means the writing's going to be less neat. That's I, all right. I, I mean... Yeah, I can still make it out, you know? Yeah, yeah, it's good. Yeah. So what do we think old boy Rotto's going to do now with his Titan abilities? So He's going to eat Eren for sure. Rotto's turned into a really big skeletal Titan. He's going to try to eat Eren. I think they're going to take Hanji, take Eren, escape, run away. I'm hoping that's the next episode. I know. I don't know what Kenny's going to do, though. That's the thing. Yeah, no clue what he has Kenny's... To, he has to reassess now. Where does his... Agenda lie, like what's he going to do? Yeah. Why did he want the power of the Titan anyway? Maybe he just wanted to be in charge. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, maybe. He doesn't seem like a nice dude. So, mm. maybe he was once, but I don't know. He looks pretty messed up now. Thank you so much for watching our reaction. If you liked it, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe. It would really help us out. For early access to all of our reactions, you can support us on Patreon if you'd like. And yeah, thank you so much again. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.